for joining me on Win Life TV. My name is Elizabeth Morris of Social with Elizabeth, and this is Get Social. Today I want to look at your Pinterest account. There's a relatively new feature on Pinterest called a showcase that's right at the top of your Pinterest profile, and you can select certain pin boards to showcase in that spot, and they will kind of do a um, screenshot scroll across the top of your screen, and it's a great way to uh, showcase some of your best pin boards or the areas where you have a lot of expertise and you want those to be noticed first thing when people go to your Pinterest account. So I'm gonna walk you through how to set those up today. If you wanna take a look at my screen, I already have my Pinterest profile pulled up here and you can see this part that's scrolling through down here is where I have set my um, showcase up already with some of my best pin boards. I'm just going to let it scroll through there for a second so you th can see what it looks like. I have Pinterest board covers set up, so that's what the big one you see here is. And then inside are individual pins that are inside of that pin board. Now, if you just hover right over top of that, you'll get your little edit feature there. And I am actually going to clear mine out so that we can go through setting it up together. So for your spot number one, you click on that and it will pull up all of your different Pinterest boards. So I am going to put my Pinterest for Business board up there, my Facebook tips, my Twitter tips, and let's see what else, Instagram tips. and social media management. All right, so I selected those boards and I save them. It's super easy to set those up. And then you have that nice feature at the top of your Pinterest profile. Since there's no big profile header uh, image or a big picture at the top of Pinterest, this is a really nice way to display some of your pin boards as soon as people land on your profile. What you will want to make sure is that, as you can see through here, as it scrolls through the boards, it will tell you how many pins I have in those boards. You want to use some of your best boards. So pick boards that you have a lot of pins in. Pick boards that you have a lot of your own pins in, not just pins that you've shared from other places or from other websites. Get your own information in there because this is going to catch people's interest and when they click on it, it's going to take them right to that board. So you want a board that's very well developed, filled out, has good descriptions in it, has great images because that's what Pinterest is all about, and you'll probably start seeing more interest in those specific boards. Anytime you want to, if you want to feature something different, if you're having a contest, if you're having a sale, if you're having a special promotion, then go ahead and swap those out and put that board up there so that people will be drawn to that board when they click on your profile. This is a really easy way to focus some interest on those specific boards. So you can see this one for my Facebook tips. I have a lot of pins in there. So that's a good one to feature. We're going to go back and there it started scrolling again. So like I said before, those are my, those are my cover board pages, which um, if you have any interest in learning how to do that, send me an email and I can send you a PDF with specific instructions for the dimensions of those boards and how to create those for you. Um, it just gives a very clean, cohesive look um, throughout your account that way. And then the pins that you have inside of there. So if there's any specific pen on those boards that you're wanting to draw attention to when you create this, if either repen them again or delete a pen if it's an old one and you don't want to keep it there anymore and repen it back in the top and then that will show up as one of these very first thing when they click on there. If you have any questions about Pinterest or any other social media account, please send me an email at socialwithelizabeth at gmail.com. I would love to answer your questions about social media. All right, I kind of goofed that up. You want to zoom in now? <laughs> Okay. Thank you for joining me today on Win Life TV. Make sure to look on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays for the latest episode of Get Social. 
If you have any social media questions, if you have a problem or you're looking for an answer for something you're doing on your social media accounts, please send me an email. It's socialwithelizabeth at gmail.com. I would love to help you stand out from the crowd on social media. Thank you for watching and have a great day.